Pet Pals TV continues wherever you're watching us around the country today. We appreciate it. Make sure you go online. We're at PetPalsTV.com. That's where we are all the time. This time in the special edition, Patty is down in Florida. And she's not only hanging out with the stars of the show, she's hanging out with their caretakers too. Patty? Here at the Clearwater Aquarium with... Abby Stone. And you are a trainer for... Clearwater Marine Aquarium. Okay, so you're not just relegated to winter and hope. You also help with other dolphins as well? I do. We have right now three dolphins, wow. Nicholas, Winter, and Hope, and I work with all three of those animals. I also work with animals that are sick or injured and come here to get better and okay. then be released back into yeah. the wild. Yeah. See, that's something we want to mention. This is wonderful for a movie, but obviously this is not your purpose. Your mission is to rescue, rehabilitate, and release? Absolutely, yes. And we've been uh, very successful over the years releasing dolphins, river otters, and hundreds to maybe thousands of sea turtles. Okay. Your popularity, of course, has skyrocketed across the world, I would imagine. It has. We've had many visitors since Dolphin Tail One. And actually before that, you know, yeah. Winter's story got out into the media and we've had people uh, just very intrigued by her and wanting to see her. Um, but it's great because what it does is allow us to show the world what we do here and why it's so important to protect these animals and really what they can do to help as well. Okay. Somebody out there watching and they go, you know what, I would like to be like you. I'd like to be a trainer. What should they do? Okay. Okay, well, most trainers have a background in psychology. So you oh, want really? your yes, you want your four-year degree. And this is general psychology. It's not animal psychology. Okay. It's, it's the same principles that you and I use every single day to oh, interact with our so friends smart. and family. That's right. And, and that really applies to dolphins and any living creature, for that matter. And so what we do is focus on positive reinforcement. So we reward our animals when they do a good job, and we build relationships with them to help to facilitate everything that we do, including some of the medical behaviors, right. but also some of the research behaviors behaviors that we do to learn more about them so that ultimately we can contribute to conservation. Wow. I'm a big fan of positive reinforcement. Me too. Thank you very much. Thank you. I'll pat you. Thank How's you. that? <laughs> I like that. Get a treat. I, I especially like candy. <laughs> well, who doesn't? Yeah. Okay. Thank you so much. Thank you, ma'am. Dolphin Debbie, I like that. Dolphin Tail 2 here at Clearwater, Florida. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.